Hi, how are you? Hope you're well. Right, this week I want to talk to you about The Other Side. This is one of those films that you watch and then it just lingers with you for days and days and days. It's the work of documentarian Roberto Minervini and it has been described as a documentary. It's supposedly a documentary about those living on the margins of society in America, but it's quite an unusual film. Not yet sort of conventional, traditional documentary. As one reviewer said, it's kind of like a cross between reality TV and an art film. Whatever it is, it is a very disturbing and powerful look at life, um, living life in extreme poverty. So we spend most of our time in the poor Louisiana town of West Monroe and we follow a guy called Mark Kelly and his girlfriend Lisa as they live their lives, which um, much of is devoted to smoking crystal meth. Now Mark also makes crystal meth and watching him inject his girlfriend and in another scene a pregnant stripper kind of makes you lose faith in humanity a little bit. His racist and sexist rants don't help either and yet Mark himself hasn't lost faith in himself. Not entirely, he works part-time jobs, he tries to look after his family and he has plans to clean himself up but to be honest hope is pretty hard to come by in this film. After about an hour Minervini drifts away from Mark and he focuses on a group of military veterans who have an apocalyptic view of the world and are preparing to deal with a, a tyranny that they believe will soon come and confiscate their many, many guns. Um, yeah, this is a film filled with people who are tired and angry at the world, who are fed up with hopelessness and who feel forgotten and hated by society and the government, and in particular um, Obama in this case. I don't know how Minervini managed to get such intimate access to his subjects, but in doing so, he has created a sober, sobering, harrowing, and very compelling film. So The Other Side screens on Thursday, August the 9th. Hey, also this week I want to mention Aussie film Down River. It stars Kerry Fox in Reef Island. It tells the story of a young man who's released from prison and goes about seeking atonement for the crime that he was supposed to have committed as a kid. The mystery at the heart of this uh, film is that a young boy um, drowns at a river and his body is never found and it's thought that he's been murdered and our protagonist was, um, has been held responsible for that. But it's clearly a much more complicated situation. This is a moody and sensual Aussie flick. We've kind of been down this mystery thriller road before but Reef Island plays his character so well that you can't help but find out how it all ends up. Hey, and don't forget that Rialto Documentary is screening documentaries about fashion icons on Wednesday evenings in August, and Rialto Channel customers can be in to win a VIP New Zealand Fashion Weekend Escape for Two. So the prize includes accommodation at M Social Hotel in Auckland, a $500 flight centre gift card, and two front row tickets to the Zambezi Runway Show and more. So all you have to do is go to rialtochannel.co.nz slash New Zealand Fashion Weekend and get yourself in the draw. Why wouldn't you? See you next week.